and then and then and then Batman. Batman. Hi. What's going on? My name is Wuffles, and uh, please ignore that intro. Uh, <laughs> welcome back to Attack of the B Team, and it is the next day, even if it is uh, a little late. I do apologize. I've been uh, out busy shopping with my pop, going out to dinner, and hanging out with the fam. So uh, I, I did make a promise that I would upload uh, an Attack of the B Team episode if you guys crushed the like button on the previous episode. You got like 6,000 likes in a day. I mean, like... That's unreal. That's the I can't even I can't even fathom that that number. It's just uh, as someone who's been doing this for that long. It's just like, oh my god, you guys are absolutely ridiculously supportive, and it's just insane. It really keeps me motivated. It really keeps me happy. So thank you so much. Uh, if we want to continue that on this episode, no light goals. This is a bonus episode, really. So whatever you guys want to do, I would appreciate it. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and do some some hanging out, some building. We want to get to know each other. We're gonna we're gonna you know bring each other out to dinner and. Uh, you know, do all that fun stuff. So, uh, where you took Theo, and I'll get to wine, and we can go wine and dan. Uh, so, in this episode, I wanted to do two things. I wanted to work with carpenter blocks so that uh, we can uh, get away from leaf decay. So, I want to make carpenter blocks, and I think I know how. Carpenter blocks. The only hard part is going to be getting these a chisel and the hammer. Actually, not really. So, carpenter blocks. Just sticks and uh, wood planks. Really, really simple. So we can go ahead and start doing these things. Start making the carpenter blocks and we can change it to anything we want. Uh, what is this river cane? How dare you? I, you piece of, you poop. Ooh, a carpenter's bed. We're going to have to make ourselves a carpenter's bed. That's going to have to happen. Carpenter's safe. Block of iron. Let's make that too. We'll make a whole bunch of, of carpenter stuff, but... Uh, before we dip into any of that, uh, I really want to make, I was just flying around my base, just kind of seeing how it looks. And I love like the, the, the dance swirls that we got going on here. Things coming out there, popping out here. It gives it a really cool look. Um, and it looks complicated, which, which I like. It looks rustic. Um, doesn't really have a rhyme or reason. So I really wanted to put up supports for this. Uh, large dining room area because this is like the main part. I didn't want to just do like normal beams and I might even change out these beams because I think they look really ugly. You know what? Let me just go turn off clouds real quick. Uh, there, clouds off just because it makes it really hard to see. Uh, so those beams don't look great and I'm definitely going to want to get rid of it. So I wanted to think of something different to do uh, for these beams and I was thinking of having these kind of uh, arcing kind of supports. So what I'm going to do for that is I'm going to go down um, I'm trying to think how I want to do this. Probably going to be best if I just do one, two, three, four, five. And then um, move over. So that's kind of like the main part of the arc. One, two, three, four, five. And usually, one like, usually builders, what they do is they go into creative and they figure this all out uh, beforehand. And I'm a, not necessarily lazy, but I've never really done that. So we're actually going to stay away from that. Um, but yeah, maybe put like a a staircase right here. I probably should go make a couple. Uh, I wonder what staircases look like for this. Uh, the the, the Fear, fear wood, firewood. I'm sure to call it firewood. Uh, so let's go ahead and let's make a couple planks here and make a stair. I'm sure it looks pretty bad, but we're gonna keep them in for now, and then we'll we'll replace them if we have to. We got eight, that should be enough. So let's just go ahead and play around with this real quick. So even I think even five is a little too much. We might want to even just stick to three because I think with five it's gonna be really hard to get that that arc feel. All right, so this is that's four. So let's go ahead and break this one more bad boy. It's always hard to break when flying. Come on, Bat. You can do better than that. You're Batman. Oh, God, gotcha. All right, so one more. And... Okay, cool. So now that we have these three, do maybe like a like a stair. Oops. Um, but like a... Well, we'll, we'll do the stair after. Uh, but for now, I'm thinking we then do... Oops. Uh, let's go ahead and bring this bad boy up into our hot bar. Uh, one... two like that to the side and then we break these obviously i should have scaffolding it would be a lot easier for me to break things but you know uh and then we do pretty much the same thing we'll do two again then we'll do one so we'll go we'll go uh out one two and then we'll do one just like that that's pretty cool uh, and then, for example, we put the we put the staircases in here, 
like that. And then uh, we'd get rid of we'd get rid of these these ugly. I really don't like the way this looks. By the way, I'm just gonna say that the the log version is a lot nicer. Uh, the log version is actually okay, but uh, it's it's not bad for support. So for now for now we'll just keep it in just to kind of get the look going. Uh, something like that, and then probably up here too. So we're gonna need a lot more stairs. So that, that's actually a pretty cool look. And then now that we have this one, we'll do kind of like a, a one, two, just maybe one, two, yeah, one, two, and then uh, bring it down a little bit, and then do one, two, three, and then bring it down a little bit, and then do one, two, three. Okay, that's still, that looks good. We can actually we can actually go straight right about here, just like that, and then we can maybe even link it up here, um, and then and then go go all the way. Oops, uh, go all the way in to the to the tree here. Um, oh, oh God, I'm starving. Eat, eat, eat. I did not know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, little batty. I apologize. I did not know you were hungry. I did not know. And like that. Okay, great. So let's go ahead and break these bad boys. Uh, right and break this guy. And uh, there you go. So we have this this kind of cool arc that I think looks a lot better. We can kind of maybe fill it in with a design or or work on it, but that's uh, that's a lot better than than just that straight down design. Um, play around with it, add some add some cool stuff. But that looks that looks good. Let's see if uh, our fellow here, uh, our friend here, is uh, is tired. You bet. There we go. It's always on, man. When I'm on, it's like me and me and Chimney are on the same clock. Maybe that's a, not a good thing. I'm on the same time zone as uh, the Dark Lord. Probably not a good call. <laughs> Probably gonna get myself killed. You are now in morph. Darn it! All right, come back. Become Wolfles again. I know. Boring, boring Wolfles. What a little noob. Uh, sleep. Hey, sleep, sleep. Ah, okay, there we go. And then uh, hopefully he is waiting for me, and we shall rest together. We shall get in our beds together and rest. It'll be glorious and delicious. All right, so turn back into the bat because being Wuffles is boring. And uh, go ahead and jump in here. Definitely something I'm going to want to do is... Ooh, what about... I love... I, I, you know what? I, I don't do it enough is I don't work with fences enough. And they could actually be really, really cool. Um, really cool additions to builds. Definitely have some hanging lights on here. I'm gonna have to go to the Nether at some point. But all right, let's just let's just imitate this uh, in exactly how we uh, how we just did it here. So this is three, and then we put a stair here. But I'll just do I'll just do this for now, and then we do sideways. So one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. I can do the mathematics. You sex thing. You sex thing. I believe in miracles. You sex thing. You sex thing. All right, I'm going to stop. <laughs> All right, and this actually doesn't have to go very far. Uh, ooh, those fence posts there, I actually kind of really like. Let's go ahead and see how that looks. We'll, we'll put them, we'll put them. Oh, that looks good. That looks a lot better than these, these plants. That looks a lot better than the planks. Not a lot, not a lot better, but it does look better. I definitely think we could do a better job, but we'll leave that. We'll leave that for now. But this is just kind of an example. We can even make that into like a second floor, maybe. Uh, fill this in here and then have kind of like a. Wait, I know we wanted to do this balcony here, but you know what? It's a cool design. We're gonna keep it. We're gonna work with it. Um, I think it gives us some good options. But for now, it's just really cool to have that as the as our as our um, our structure. Let's just build this up. Maybe oh, let me just go to my storage real quick. I know I have more of those planks somewhere or logs. I do, I do, I do, I do. All right, we also have all these. We have that rubber wood, which I don't know how that looks. We do have a lot of the mangrove wood, which is pretty sweet when uh, when broken down into this nice kind of white wood. We're actually going to do that to all of this. Maybe start using it. It's kind of a really nice look. But kind of, I mean, really is. Really is quite something special. Uh, so if we do this and just make it look a little bit more uh, rugged or rigid, and you know maybe we'll oh hello, hello buddy. I mean goodbye. See you later, buddy. All right, let's oh look at that. That actually connects quite perfectly. Uh, and you know let's just feed this. Let's just feed this through. And yeah, look really cool, like that. Oh wow, that looks that looks awesome. Sweet. Okay, so that's really coming together. Um, I wonder what we can do with the mangrove wood to give it like a nice feel. Uh, maybe, maybe do like connecting beams or something with this white. 
would be kind of cool or maybe like a trim i think when i can break it down and start doing like like outlines and stuff this white wood is going to look really good but i need to do tinker's construct for that so let's put this away for now um but i really do think that's going to be like long term awesome long term awesome hashtag uh okay cool so now that we have this done let's go do it let's start moving on that that carpenter block uh grind I don't really want to put these 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 in. I'm just going to leave this for now just because uh, we'll finish it up when we find a better texture. Maybe you guys give me some ideas. But uh, this is looking... It's looking funky. That's that's what I wanted. It's looking really weird. Um, there's going to be all sorts of different areas to like walk in through. And it's cool. Each room step by step. So let's get that carpenter block uh, up and running. So we're going to probably just use the rest of this firewood. Turn that into sticks. Uh, go ahead and grab Ooh, what the what the oh, I'm only doing okay. There we go uh, grabbing those into sticks Let's See if we have any extra just normal things I can make out of plank that I don't really care about for example This willow wood nobody likes willow wood. It's quite hideous. I think oh god That is just just outrageously terrible. Don't tell him I said that though because that's a little rude uh, All right, so we're gonna do half this way just do this and we got our carpenter blocks, so I'm excited I haven't really dipped into carpenter blocks. I've seen a little, a couple of videos with them, so I'm pretty sure I know how to use them. Definitely going to need that hammer, and I know that you can do all sorts of really weird things with them, so I cannot wait to do that. The first thing that we're going to need for the carpenter blocks is just these basic things. We're going to use the trim to make the the, uh, the windows, uh, and we're going to need the leaf blocks. So we're gonna, we don't have any leaf blocks left. We're going to have to make some shears. I know I have some shears in here. All right, so we're going to have to go shear some leaves, which we can totally do quite easily because we have all these wonderful trees here. I actually just planted, by the way, I've chopped down a lot of trees. I've planted a lot of trees. So don't worry, don't worry. Those will hopefully grow. You can see them. Uh, I've planted a couple of them, bam, right there, right there. So don't worry. I am uh, I'm being a responsible citizen. Why is this? Okay, there we go. It's a little bit laggy for some reason, uh, but that's okay. We can work. We can work around it. It's every once in a while, we are we are not fighting any sort of witches or battles. We are just building, so we can we can handle just a little bit of lag. I, I think so. All right. So, oh, the shear is gone. All right. So, I'm just <laughs> I just started hitting it with a pork chop. I'm like damn you tree, be hit by my pork chop. Be with a girl. <laughs> that would be that'd be epic if I fought a tree with a pork chop. All right, let's just go ahead and just chop the rest of the tree down just so that it, it decays. We don't really need any more of these uh, of these leaves, I don't think, because we already got we already got over a stack, so we should be okay. We should be just fat. All right, so whoo, this is going all the way down, all the way down to the ground. All right, cool, so let's head back up. Look how cool that looks. That is awesome. That is really, really cool. I, I'm loving this. I'm loving this. I'd love to get a tree, bam, right up there in the middle, but we'll, uh, we'll work on that later on. So let's just, let's just try this out. I'm just going to put a carpenter block right here. Uh, what breaks a carpenter block? That's okay. I feel like it could break it a lot faster. Wood? Okay, so the, we definitely need the hammer. And then I think you just right-click, oh, and then we have that thing. That's great. Oh, and you can actually expand it a little bit. Do like a double layer, give it like a nice look. Whoa. Oh, this is going to get sheared. Is that a carp? Why'd that take so long to break? Because it was technically attached to the carpenter's block. Let's see if it breaks if I just left click it. It does. All right, weird. And then if I just left click this. Whoa, okay, so you get all of it back. That's that's really cool. Uh, so let's just go ahead and build that hammer just so we have our carpenter uh, things ready to rock and roll. Uh, we're going to need a carpenter block and a thing of iron, which we got. We actually let's grab a whole bunch because we're going to need to make the hammer and the chisel. So let's go ahead and I think it was uh, this to make the carpenter's chisel. And I'm assuming the hammer is something like that. If I had to build a hammer, that's what it'd be. Build that hammer, uh, sugar. All right, let's just see. I guarantee I was really close. And if not, it would be an embarrassing day for Mr. Waffles. Uh, carpenter's hammer. <sighs> Damn it. <laughs> Makes total sense. It really does. All right, so we got our two bad boy blocks right there. Anything else we need from the carpenter stuff that we can build right now? Why not? Uh, carpenter oblique interior slope. Can you handle that, bro? I don't even know how to build that. I think you need some sort of like, apparently it can burn carrots. Thank God. Carpenter block. Um, yellow wool. I think that's from a different mod or something. Carpenter's collapsible block. What would that do? Apparently it can cook snails. Thank God for that. Um, 
Carpenter lever. What do we want to do? We want to do the carpenter stair, so it's a full stair. Uh, we really want to make this carpenter safe. You know what? Let's just go do that, because that's that's pretty badass. We are taking care of our fires. Uh, let's go ahead and make an iron block. I think it was it was iron, right? It wasn't like silver or anything crazy. Uh, and then we just go ahead and make our... Oh, redstone. We <laughs> I think we have some redstone. I think we have a little bit of redstone to, to use there. All right, let's just grab this thing up here. Put the redstone down here. Uh, bang, bang, bang. And then put that bad boy right here. Carpenter safe. So I don't know what you do with this, but we're going to put it right here. And then we are going to open it. And it's cool. What does it do? We can hammer it. Items can be extracted only. Items can be inserted only. Items can be inserted and extracted and disabled. <gasps> that is so cool. So we can actually like put things in there and then make it so only people can take it out. So like, let's say you're working on a big project or whatever, and you put a whole bunch of resources in, you only want people to be able to put stuff in. All the other carpenters can't steal your stuff. And when you're a carpenter, that's a big deal. So uh, let's go ahead and put nothing in there, <laughs> but it's definitely gonna look pretty. Um, all right, so let's go ahead and start working on this design here. Again, probably should have gone into game mode to uh, get a better idea. But we're going to turn into Wuffles because I expect that when people show up to my dinner party, they are not rude and don't show up as bats and they show up as actual Minecraft players because that would be cool and it'd be uncool if they showed up as bats. So let's go ahead and place these carpenter blocks down. So I just kind of broke what I was using as an idea of what I wanted to do. But let's just do this. So let's say the window is 5x5. Five five. One, two, three, four, five. Break one, two, three, four, five. Break one, two, three, four, five. That's perfect. Uh, a little bit perfect. We can just extend this, I guess, a little bit uh, when we get a little bit more wood, but that'll work. Uh, why am I always so hungry? My lord, I'm just I'm a hungry bat. Uh, but this will this will do. What we could do is we can let's just see if I can figure this out here. If we put it towards the edge and just do one, two, three, four, five. And then have this bad boy right here. Uh, only maybe three. Three and like a little bit different. So he would go um, one, two, three. It'd have to be four. Yeah, he could be four. And I'll just do like a straight up. It'd be really cool. And then maybe I can hang like curtains or something on it. That'd be sweet. So for this design, we're going to do these first five. Um, I was thinking about doing a circle. Uh, so what, what I mean by that is essentially, um, let's just go ahead and, and do it. Maybe just on the exterior here and make it easier for us to build. And we will use this disgusting green or whatever you want to call it. So uh, there will be three on the bottom. And then essentially it'll go one. Uh, we're going to have to turn back into the bat. I know it's a tough life turning into Batman. You know, sorry. I'm sorry. So for this, it would be one and then one. And then we would go um, to the side. Because we don't... How, how tall do we really want this? I mean... I guess we could actually we can actually go two here. Uh, what well, should not have broken that, uh, and then do uh, one, two, three. Something simple. This is really really simple. Uh, one, two, three, and then one, two. Basic basic stuff here. I think this will look pretty good. I wish it had a little bit more of a slant. So. Let's go ahead and make it have a little bit more of a slant. We could start it maybe more in the middle, and then uh, is it already nighttime? Holy moly, this uh, this episode is going quickly. we got to get this design down. We'll do one window, and then I'll finish it up off camera. Uh, but okay, let's start it Let's start it a little bit more in the center here. Make it go a little bit more circular instead of just like kind of straight up. Um, let's go ahead and place three, and then we'll do one, and then it'll go one, two, and then this will go one, and this will go one, two, two. Uh, that should look pretty good. And then we go ahead and obviously just get rid of the outline here, like so. And we'll fill that in with other stuff, like whatever that looks good. Like that. And then go ahead and repeat this on the top. So it's just one block and then the three, one, two, three, and then the one block. Uh, did I do that right? I did do that right. Awesome. Okay, cool. So we just break this one. And we break that one. And we got ourselves up. Oh. Oh, still looks a little wonky. Um, we got to break this and this one. Okay, cool. So that's our outline for the window. Pretty simple, pretty cool. I think that's going to be nice. Let's go ahead and do this with the carpenter blocks now. This is the brilliant part about having yourself a little outline is it should not be too difficult to make. And then we go ahead and put our leaves on there. Oh, yeah. That's going to be sweet. Look at that. Actually, the 
freaking green wood actually doesn't look that bad behind there. It kind of gives it a little bit of depth. I'm really happy about that. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to go off camera for just a second and uh, just kind of like work on this for a little bit. Probably do the middle, um, finish up this side and maybe do that side if I have enough stuff. And I'll be right back in just a second and ultra cut. Okay, welcome back. It is daytime. Uh, super exciting. And the reason is it looks good in the daytime. I'm really excited because we did it all at night. I didn't realize. And then I actually looked at it. I'm super excited to finish up this place. You ready? And bada bing, bada boom. That's a pretty cool wall. I'm not going to lie. Uh, now we just fill it in. And uh, I got to work actually a way to move this bridge somewhere else because it's going to be kind of weird or maybe move it a little bit lower. But this looks really cool. So what I did is I actually used the carpenter hammer and went ahead and see, I pushed it in. So you can actually do that really quickly by just right clicking. So uh, right click, uh, oops, but push it the, the other way, but it goes through like a rotation. And uh, the first thing is uh, boom, sunken in, sunken in. So um, I sunk them in and it looks really, really cool. It's got that nice dimension. Uh, so now we just got to kind of fill in the walls here and oh, look, this isn't, that's not good. Uh, there we go. All right. So, oh, sugar. I messed up. I messed up. Let's turn these into normal blocks. Can you become normal, please? Thank you. My God, it's so hard for blocks to be normal these days. Uh, anyway, so now I just need to like fill in the wall, uh, add it to the other side, do a little bit of lighting, and I think that's going to be really good. So the last thing I wanted to do before this episode ends this quick little special episode, and by quick I mean like 25 to 30 minute episode, because that's how we roll, was uh, make a carpenter's bed. Because I have no idea what it does, but I feel like it's Wuffles the carpenter here. And what would a carpenter be without his good old carpenter carpenter door, uh, carpenter bed? I mean, you got it. You got to hit it up. So I got that wool. Where did I put it? I feel like I put it in my super extreme chest. I did not. I feel like I put it in my mob's chest. I did not. Uh, I need one of those like auto loaders where people, you just like type it in and you just get it. I don't know what that is, but here is my wool. There it is. I see it. All right, so uh, a, one, a two, a three, and then we have seven blocks left. Let's just do a bada bing and a bada boom, and we got a carpenter's bed. And I feel like this is way more badass than this piece of poop, so we're actually going to put this bed right here, uh, and it's going to live. Oh, it looks so cool. I can only sleep, but I want to sleep now. It looks so awesome. Um, that makes me that makes me happy. Now, we need a little bit of safeguard here just so we don't, uh, we don't foul off. Um, and then this is probably a really bad place to put it. So we're actually going to break it and put it somewhere else <laughs> because I'm realizing I actually might pop off. Uh, let's go ahead and replace this, this ugly bed with that. Oh, holy, holy bed. That looks great. That look, someone take a, someone take a selfie with me with the bed. Cause it looks that good. Take a selfie. There we go. All right. Awesome. So anyways, that's going to be this episode. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like. Check everything out in the description below. The people who are playing on the server, the mod pack, if you guys want to play it. It's been a lot of fun, and I'm really, really enjoying it. An obvious thing to try and do these as often as possible, but you guys dictate how often that is by crushing that like button and all that good stuff. So either way, I got to go. Enjoy the rest of your night. I know it is super, super late, kind of getting it up in the AM, but, you know, express episode, it happens, and I'll do another one at least uh, this weekend for sure, if not sooner. Uh, if you guys want so either way take care and oh you know what before i go if this works this might freeze i asked you guys and i hopefully it's still going because it sometimes takes a very long time but i asked you guys about because uh, right now it's to reload the whole game in the texture pack about texture packs and it was very kind of uh one side like not one-sided at all it was very mixed uh, mixed emotions and mixed feelings so it's because i didn't show you the texture pack uh so let me at least show you this texture pack in this episode and you guys can let me know what you think uh but i think it looks oh hell no oh hell no oh hell no oh hell no